and today I will introduce you how to control devices using this RDM system. Once your device successfully paired with this RDM system, it will display this page. Log in to the RDM Backage Management System, click on the device button and select your device name to view its information. You can switch tabs to assess all the information. Now, let's discuss the device control section. This section includes two main functions, device control and switching signal source. In the device control section, as you can see, there are many features available. You can remotely perform various operations on your devices, such as power off, restart, and push ODA notifications. As for the switching signal source section, you can switch the device channels. Next, let's skip the device settings section and explore application operation section. In this feature, we can start applying applications, open applications, and uninstall applications. Alright, let's explore how to send command to your devices using RDM backend management system. You will see a button resembling a small airplane under the operation button. Don't hesitate to click on it, and you will see a list. We will focus on how to install programs, sending, send videos, conduct live broadcast, and send alarm to all devices.